Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix DX12 FPS drops in Rainbow Six Siege. So first of all, uh, there's an option to do this by going on graphics settings. Just write down graphics settings on your search bar and go there. After that, you will see advanced graphics settings. You want to click on that and you want to try to toggle off variable refresh rate and see if the problem was fixed or not. If the problem was not fixed, you want to try to close any background applications on your task manager. Open it up. On task manager, you will see here processes. You can go ahead and see which has the most impact on your CPU and memory and you want to go ahead and close them. And after that, see if the problem was fixed or not. Uh, now you also want to go ahead and uh, turn off MSI Afterburner, disable it. And also if you use Riva Turner, you also want to go ahead and uh, disable it and see if the problem was fixed or not. Another thing to try is update your driver. So for example, I have NVIDIA, so I'm going to use NVIDIA app. Um, if you use AMD, you want to open up AMD app and go here on drivers at the top. And you will see if there's any drivers ready to be downloaded, download them if there's any. You also want to check for game updates right there on Steam if you are using Steam or Ubisoft, wherever. Uh, and after that, you want to go ahead and click on properties, installed files, and verify integrity of the game files. This will fix any missing or corrupted files. And the last thing to try is open up your temporary files. So you can find them on settings. Then go into the system and then scroll down and, and you will see storage. Go there and here you will see temporarily files. You want to open them. And as you can see, there's direct X shader cache. So you want to go ahead and delete it. And after it will clean up the files, um, your problem should be fixed. So if this video was helpful, guys, make sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.